beautiful people. Last night, Brian and I ventured out to my P.O. box, which I rented out about a month ago, and uh, I wanted to check it because I just hadn't been there. I figured there, you know, probably wouldn't be anything there, but um, I needed to mail some things anyways. And so we checked it, and oh my god, guys, you're so nice. I wanted to open everything on camera with you guys and just like thank each one of you individually because this is so freaking nice. Like seriously, thank you so much. This made my day and night, and I really wanted to open them last night. But I didn't, I, like I wanted to have you guys with me while I opened things. So here we go. Let's start with a card from Elizabeth. Super cute sticker, by the way. Aww, this is so cute. Oh my gosh, I know who this is from. Thank you so much. Elizabeth, I truly appreciate your card and taking the time to write me. Next, a beautiful card from Richard. Got a whole letter here too. Oh my gosh, so um, Richard or Dick as he prefers to go by. I also know your your username. I've talked to you as well, I believe. Thank you so much. Shared his story of his journey, losing his leg too when he was 14. That's crazy. Thank you, this is so, so, so encouraging. Oh my gosh. Wow guys, seriously, this is amazing. Next, we have a package from Matt. If I'm strong enough to open it. Aw, oh my gosh. Like, stop it, you guys, this is so nice. Okay, so in his letter, he talks about the Osser Company, which is actually the brand that ended up doing my leg. So Matt, awesome recommendation. That's exactly, uh, exactly who I ended up using. Okay, so he's also talking about a couple other companies that make shorter legs, because, you know, my limb's a little bit longer than usual. This is so cool. He's been through all kinds of surgeries like I have, and is a blow knee amputee as well. Oh my gosh, and he started playing hockey again. That's insane! Some uh, info of him running on a treadmill with his leg and moves on the ice rink. I will definitely be checking this out as soon as I possibly can. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Last we have, actually I'm not sure who this is from. The postage is real cute, I can tell you that much. I'm gonna use scissors for this one. You know, conserve my energy. They're actually wrapped! What the heck? People are so nice! <laughs> and a car. Oh, I know exactly who this is from. Lisa, thank you. It is so great to hear from, oh my God, I feel like my voice is like so high right now. I'm exposing my super girly side. So I, I, I know your username too, obviously. We've talked back and forth a number of times. Um, this is amazing. What a sweet card and again, super duper cute. Merry Christmas to you right back. It's a little late to say Merry Christmas, but you know, still. So let's see what we have here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this book, I have never read it, but literally everyone who I respect the opinion of in my life has told me that this is like vital to read. I am really, really looking forward to this. I love reading. Um, I do it as often as I can. I'll like listen to books on Audible or actually read books when I can sit down and do it. And I have time to do that now. This, for years, like years, people have told me to read this and I've never picked it up. I don't know why and now I have it. Thank you, this is so cool. Beautiful wrapping paper and wrapping job, I might say. <gasps> Ooh, another book. I don't actually know this one. Let's see what it is about together. It is a chanting novel that has inspired a devoted following around the world. It's about an Andalusian shepherd boy named Santiago who travels from his homeland in Spain to the Egyptian desert in search of a treasure buried near the pyramids. Along the way, he meets a gypsy woman, a man who calls himself king, and an alchemist all of whom point Santiago in the direction of his quest. This will be so cool, awesome. This sounds like my kind of book. And last but not least, <gasps> ooh. Okay, I don't know if I've actually said on this channel or not, but I am crazy about dark chocolate, specifically dark chocolate. Like, I don't discriminate against chocolate, but um, the darker the chocolate, the better. This is 70%, which is fantastic. I've not seen this brand before and I love trying new ones. It's dark chocolate, sea salt, and orange. How cool is that? And also, two bookmarks to go with the two books with super awesome quotes, if I may say so. Let me make sure you can see these. And really cute designs. You guys are crazy and awesome and so, so, so sweet. And your words especially were so encouraging and your little gifts and cards. So Lisa and Matt and Richard and Elizabeth, thank you so, so, so much for reaching out to me, for sending me things. God, this is so sweet. You guys are amazing, thank you. And if you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much. I feel like this is a very self-serving kind of video, but I wanted to share this with you because I was really excited to see things in the mail from you guys, and I will definitely be writing back. So, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. I hope you're having a lovely weekend, and I will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.